hi viewers so today's topic is a meisner effect right so what is a meisner effect let me start yes meisner effect meisner is the name of the scientist who did experiment on the superconductor in the presence of magnetic field okay meisner observed that if a superconductor is cooled in a magnetic field below critical temperature corresponding to the field that field corresponding to that field then the lines of induction are expelled from the materials this effect is known as a meisner effect once again see here what is a meisner what he did he observed so that means he ex did one experiment if a superconductor already that is a superconductor is cooled in a magnetic field below critical temperature critical temperature generally we do not tc already i explained the critical temperature definition is also given in the previous video please watch that video okay mm. superconductor cooled in a magnetic field below critical temperature corresponding to that field means corresponding to this magnetic field then what happens then the lines of inductions are expelled expelled means they cannot uh, move lines of forces like this through the substance they come outside like this okay so expelling means coming outside they cannot penetrate through they cannot uh, penetrate or cannot move through the substance so such a uh, from the material so such effect no are known as meisner effect so like this we call meisner effect meisner effect means simply a substance what we have to do we have to keep it in the magnetic field and uh, cool down it okay so while cooling it uh, below transition temperature means so okay, where the conversion starts that is a transition temperature conversion means normal conductor to superconductor okay conversion starts then suddenly suddenly magnetic lines of forces come outside and they cannot penetrate through the substance that is expelled we call from the figure a superconductor in normal state and a magnetic lines of forces for a magnetic lines of force pass through it so this is okay so when it is in a normal state now but when specimen is cooled below its transition temperature okay or critical temperature then magnetic lines of forces are expelled out of specimen okay so but when specimen is cooling under water below transition temperature then magnetic lines of forces are or expelled so coming outside of the specimen or the substance the expulsion means uh, outside uh, coming outside mag that is expulsion meaning the expulsion of magnetic lines of force from a superconducting material when it is cooled below transition temperature in a magnetic field is called meisner effect so meisner effect is simply in magnetic field okay so we have to pre make a substance normal state to superconducting state under magnetic field then only this can uh, this thing will happen okay meisner effect is a reversible when the temperature is increased below tc the flux suddenly penetrate through the specimen and the substance comes into the normal state so when it is in normal state what happens all the lines of forces passes through it when it is uh, converted into normal state to superconducting state lines of forces starts expelling like this they cannot penetrate to the substance once again what he is saying it is a reversible process that means normal conductor converted into superconductor and superconductor also convert we can convert them into normal conductor so like this a reversible process so reverse can uh, takes place here a superconductor is a perfect diamagnet so superconductor why it is a diamagnet diamagnet means actually lines of forces has to pass through the substance 
but when the substance is in a superconducting state lines of forces are expelling expelling means coming out so not penetrating so where lines of forces generally cannot penetrate through the dia magnets generally they cannot penetrate through the dia magnet so that is why here uh, what this uh, superconductor can act as a perfect dia magnet okay so superconductor is a perfect dia magnet reason is that the magnetic induction b in a superconductor is zero magnetic induction b is in a superconductor is zero means magnetic induction means lenses magnetic lenses cannot move through the cannot move through the substance they move away from the substance or outside of the substance so that is why inside magnetic field is zero but according to susceptibility also we can say so susceptibility of superconductor is negative if it is negative this is a dia okay so dia dia means it must be negative chi value chi must be negative for dia okay friends so don't forget this points keep in mind so these are this is the meissner effect so thank you friends don't forget watch this video till the end and like it and don't forget sharing to your friends okay thank you